Hey guys, it's Skylar. Welcome back to my channel. So I am not a big luxury designer person. Um, I don't own anything like luxury or designer really. Oh. I think the nearest Gucci store to me is like two hours away. <laughs> so I really didn't feel like doing that. So I just went online and I bought the cheapest item that they had on their website from Tiffany, Gucci, Chanel, and Louis Vuitton. So let's get started. <laughs> Okay, so here we are on Louis Vuitton website. I look incredibly orange, <laughs> so I don't know why I literally look like a Oompa Loompa, but it's fine. We are gonna see what we can find for the cheapest item. So let's go to, I don't know. I don't think any of their purses or clothes or any of that, like that's not gonna be the cheapest thing they have. So I think we're gonna go into this art of living category and maybe they have like a phone case or something. I don't know. Oh yeah, phone cases. Oh, $560 for a phone case. Okay, I don't think we're gonna find a phone case. I was hoping to spend under $100 and nothing in this category looks like it's gonna be under $100. So let's go back to what is connected objects? What is that? Oh my gosh, headphones. They have their own headphones for eleven hundred dollars. Uh, let's see what else they have. Let's look at games. Maybe they have some like cheap games or something. <laughs> oh, or not? It's a pool table. Imagine having a Louis Vuitton pool table, or like foosball table. <laughs> I haven't seen anything under $100 yet, so that's a little alarming. Maybe a candle, maybe? $190? I mean, that is the cheapest thing I've seen so far, so maybe decor? Origami flower, $375. Okay picture holder for $895. I do not understand the origami flower thing. Um, let's look at like a notebook. Ooh, $63. $63 for this notebook refill. These just look like little planners, agendas. $61 for, this is just the paper though. Like you don't even get the rings. It's literally just the paper. <laughs> Let's look up city guide and travel book. Oh, $56. Travel book for Barcelona. Ooh, $37. I wonder if they have Chicago. My friend went to law school in Chicago, so that would be kind of a cute gift. They have London, Tokyo, San Francisco, Moscow, Singapore, Rome, Chicago. Oh my gosh. So it's just like a Chicago city guide. I clicked on the French version, that's smart of me. Oh, that's cute. So it has like people at the bean on the back. So I think it just has like the best restaurants and like clubs and like where to go, I guess. For only $37, that'd be a cute gift. Okay, so, oh wait, let's look, let's look at pencils and pouches. $500 for a Louis Vuitton pencil pouch. Okay. Okay, so after looking around further, this is definitely the cheapest thing I can find on the website is this Chicago City Guide book for $37. So that is what we are going to get. Moving on. Let's go to Gucci. Uh, ooh, they have a children's section. So maybe we'll find like a cheap like kids sock or something. Okay, a baby Gucci hat is $170. Uh, a children's Gucci stripe headband, $165. Let's look at baby accessories. $45 for like an infant sock. Okay, let's go into decor, see what they have. Let's look at home scents. Okay, so this is a candle for $450. Uh, an incense burner for 195. Um, let's go into, Ooh. okay, so they have makeup. So that actually might be 
our best bet. Okay, an eyebrow pencil is $32. Cheaper than the baby socks. Um, I wonder how much their mascara is. Ooh, $35 for the mascara. They have this face gloss stuff, gel face gloss. I don't really know what that is, but it's $33. The eyebrow pencil is still cheaper. Let's look at their like lips. See if they have anything. 42. So the eyebrow pencil is the cheapest thing on the Gucci website. So I think we're just gonna go ahead and get that. I think I'm gonna get it in the, I think I'm gonna get it in this shade, shade four, which is the like dark brown shade. Yeah, I'm gonna get the dark brown shade for $32. All right, moving on, let's go to Chanel. <laughs> now I've actually seen a TikTok where somebody bought like cotton pads, like that you would remove your makeup with for $20. I'm, I don't know if that's the cheapest thing they have, but I'm gonna look at that first. $30 for an eyelash curler. I have a feeling makeup is probably gonna be the cheapest thing on Chanel. Oh, they have skincare. Ah, I think this is where the cotton things were. $20 for cotton. Oh, and they are sold out. <laughs> Um, it is extra soft cotton. So it's a hundred pieces of Chanel cotton. I'm gonna see if there's anything else we can find that's cheaper than $20 or $20, which I think we're gonna have to stay in the makeup section. They have nail polish, interesting. $28, aha, $25 for a healthy glow lip balm. They have five shades, light, warm, medium, deep, intense. Interesting. So that's $25. So I guess technically this isn't the cheapest thing on the website, but it's the cheapest thing they have available on the website <laughs> because the cotton pads are not available. So, and I'm gonna get it in the shade light for $25, some lip balm. <laughs> Okay, and our last place is Tiffany. I'm gonna go to the home section. Ooh, maybe like a key ring. Although the Louis Vuitton key rings were very expensive. $75 for a heart key ring. What's a desk accessory? Oh, this book. If I have to buy another book. <laughs> $30, that is pretty cheap. Let's look at coffee and tea, $50 for a plate. Mm. Bar and drinkware, $25, $25 for a cup. Oh, the shot glass is cute. Of course it's not available. Okay, so after looking around a little bit more, the $25 cups are definitely the cheapest thing that they have. So I think I'm gonna get the wine glass. I think I'm gonna go with the white one, the white wine glass. It's like a little bit skinnier and the red wine is a little bit bigger, I guess. But we're gonna go with the white wine one and that'll be it. So the first item that came was the Tiffany wine glass. That was the first item that was delivered. It came really quickly. I ordered everything on a Wednesday and the Tiffany wine glass came here on Fat Friday. So it literally came like two days later. So the shipping was really awesome. So I actually gave the Tiffany wine glass to my mom as a gift because I really had no use for it and I don't even drink wine. <laughs> so. I wanted to give it to her. I thought it'd be something fun. I know she doesn't have anything from Tiffany, so I thought this would be a cool gift to give my mom. So here is me giving her her gift. Mm. It's like Christmas. Is it kind of wish? 
<laughs> no, it's definitely not from Wish. Is it edible? No, it's not edible. Is Sorry. It... And then the bread box. Is, Is it from me? Tiffany? <laughs> oh, whoa. Am I hitting Oh my them? gosh, wait, take it out nicely. <laughs> Am I hitting the mother load or what? It's a big box. Oh my gosh, that's wow. so cute. <laughs> that is a vibrant color. It's Tiffany blue. I love you, mom. Aw, I couldn't have asked for a better mother love skirt. I want to see the card. Oh. Does it, it says Tiffany on it? It's embossed. Oh, like really tiny. Wow. I don't even think you can see that. Okay, Tiffany. And then my little letter that I wrote. <laughs> that was free, by the way. You can get a free card. Should okay, I pull so string? open it up. <gasps> oh. Wow. Let's see. That's a very nice box. It is. <laughs> I love that color. What in the heck is going to be in here? <laughs> they really have a lot of good bubble wrap. So I don't know if I told you the idea behind this video, but I went on designer websites and I bought the cheapest item they have <laughs> from designer websites. And this is the cheapest thing they sell at Tiffany's. Guess how much that was? It's also it says Tiffany and company right on the bottom. Pretty. Oh yeah. 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 Oh, there you go. So you can see it says Tiffany and co on it. You know what? This is like, this right here is very dainty. I yeah, mean, it's, it's a, you know, it's a sturdy glass, but that right there is very... How much do you think it was? I don't know. It's Tiffany. It was $25. <laughs> now you have a Tiffany oh, wine glass. Hello. <laughs> like it? Yes, it's beautiful. Okay, so <laughs> Chanel. The Chanel box came and it came in this giant box even though it's literally a chapstick or lip balm it came in this massive box and inside it it was wrapped nicely i already opened this sorry it came with the chanel tissue paper it's really nice um then you open it up and here's all of our stuff so here is like the receipts like your receipt and like your shipping stuff if you want to return um all that information is in this and then this came in there so we got two free samples with our chanel order and the first one was this perfume which i smelled this earlier and i'm pretty sure this is cologne it smells more like a masculine scent I don't know it smells good but I I'm pretty sure this is cologne but it smells nice we also got the mascara and I tried using the mascara and I am honestly not a fan of this it's not very good the brush is kind of large and not very nice in my opinion and it smells weird so those two things came in this little Chanel, I don't know if you can see that, but it says Chanel on the bottom. Um, this little Chanel bag, which is kind of cute, I guess. Okay, so our $25 Healthy Glow Lip Balm. It's very tiny, it's cute. This is in the shade Light. It just has the Chanel logo on top, and it's just a black, there's no other design on it. And it looks like that. That's actually very bright. There's definitely some color payoff. It's, it does show up. Like I thought this was gonna be more of just like a chapstick type thing where it was gonna be clear. It's actually kind of pigmented. It has some color to it. So honestly, it just feels like a regular like lip balm. Like I don't see anything super special about this, honestly. Lovely, but is it worth $25 though? I don't think so. I think you could get this, something very similar quality to this from the drugstore. Okay, up next we have Gucci. So the Gucci came in this cardboard box. So it came in a Gucci bag. 
It did not come in a box like Chanel. And here is our eyebrow pencil. So I got this in shade four, I believe, which is like the second darkest shade they have. Cause they have, this is the dark brown and they have black, but this is the dark brown. And here it is. And it came with a pencil sharpener um, that says Gucci on it. Super bougie. It has a spoolie on one end and then the pencil is on the other. Pretty typical. <laughs> um, I did use this today on my eyebrows and it works pretty well. Like it's very like you don't have to press hard to get the color to show up. Um, was it worth the like 30 whatever dollars? Um, again, probably not. <laughs> um, I mean, it's nice, but it's very standard, I would say. <laughs> would I buy it again? No. And our last product, our Louis Vuitton. So again, they have their own like box, shipping box thing. And then we have our Louis Vuitton. That's all of our shipping stuff. And then here's our book. That's really cute, look at the back. It has like this little latch thing. I think my friend's really gonna like this. This is really cute so far. All right, so let's open it up. Ooh, oh, it comes wrapped. Okay, so here it is. Here is the Louis Vuitton Chicago book. <laughs> city, the Louis Vuitton City Guide book. So they have like a whole section on gourmet delis and like farmer markets that they have in Chicago, I guess, that you can go to nightlife like clubs and stuff in chicago oh and it came with stickers has like museums like just places to go and things to see in chicago the back's really cute of the bean that's really cute okay well this is your gift <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of heavy oh my god that's so cute i know isn't it cute oh my gosh <laughs> oh my gosh thank you you're welcome all right, that is all I have for you guys. Those are my four items. Did I think they were worth the price? Nah, not really. Um, I mean, it was fun like getting like designer items, I guess, but were they worth it? I don't think so. <laughs> I mean, you, you're, you're paying for the name, the brand, that's what you're paying for, um, which is fine if that's what you're into, but I don't know. Nothing was like super special about them, I don't think, but that's just my opinion. <laughs> but anyways, thank you guys for watching. Please subscribe and I will see you guys next time.